Hi, I'm Janet Littlewood. I'm a recognised specialist in veterinary dermatology and I'd like to talk about the flaky cat. Cats with excessive dandruff and scaling uh, can be afflicted by a large number of underlying diseases. Um, all mammals, cats, dogs, us, we're all growing a new layer of skin all the time and the top layer is, is shedding as part of our normal life. But in the normal situation, you don't notice that and um, your cat's normal grooming behaviour with a healthy skin, you won't be aware of that skin flaking off at the surface. So if you become aware of it, that has to be because there is an abnormality of turnover of the skin and shedding. And that would indicate that there is an underlying pathology in the skin, but it can be associated with internal disease uh, not just dermatological diseases. Parasitic skin diseases can certainly um, affect the turnover time and the one particular parasite that we think of with scaling um, is a parasite that has the name of wandering dandruff um, and this is a parasite that can actually bite people as well as cats. It's not particularly common um, but um, it, it's fairly easily diagnosed if your veterinary surgeon takes some samples from the skin surface and looks at it under the microscope. If you have an elderly cat that has greasy, flaky skin, um, often with discoloration of the skin um, and the hair coat, you would be worried about an underlying disease of the internal organs um, that's affecting the skin metabolism, skin secretions and turnover of the skin. Um, particularly one would be worried about um, liver disease um, affecting the turnover of the skin. But there are some other fairly serious internal diseases which can result in quite marked scaling of the skin, um, in particular a couple of types of tumour. So if you've got an older cat uh, who develops a severely scaly skin, do get them to your veterinary surgeon. Um, they'll want to do a thorough, complete examination um, and may well recommend um, some investigations to check internal organs as well as looking at the skin. Uh, you might think, hey, it's only a skin problem, but it may be that this skin change is a marker of an internal disease uh, which may have great significance on your cat's health and needs to be investigated.